Church, great to be with you and to share a scripture that means something to me. And I want to share with you today from Daniel chapter 6 verse 3. It says, Daniel so distinguished himself that the king planned to set him over the whole kingdom. Daniel so distinguished himself. And I wonder today, this week, this year, in your life, are you living a life that is resulting in you becoming distinguished amongst the culture that you live in? Or are you living a life that is causing you to be extinguished by the culture? Distinguished amongst the culture or extinguished by the culture? I believe through Christ's power in us, we are able to live lives of distinction where people notice something different about us. And I believe that can be the case today. If you think about the Queen, our incredible Queen, I remember when she came to my hometown and the whole town stopped. Wherever the Queen is, the whole town, the city, wherever she is, it stops. Whenever she speaks, People take notice of what she's saying. The Queen is someone of distinction. To be distinguished means to be, uh, to have a special quality, to have style, attractiveness, and to be notable or renowned. And that is God's intention for us, His people, is to be live people that live lives of distinction. That we are distinguished even amongst the culture we live in today. We are not extinguished by the culture we live in today. I want to believe that today you can shine out, you can stand out from the rest, that people will look at you today and notice something different about the way you behave, the way you walk around your world, the way you speak about others, the way you act with integrity and honesty. Today, people can look at you and go, for you so distinguished yourself that the king set you amongst over the whole kingdom. In other words, people that live lives of distinction, influence is the natural outcome. And God wants to raise you up to cause you to do something influential today. I'm going to pray that today you live a Daniel life of being distinguished, not extinguished. God, I thank you for every audacious person today. May we live lives where we are distinguished above all of the things that we're a part of. And we are not extinguished by them. We pray we would live influential and significant lives, that we'd make great choices today, that we'd understand that your power lives in us and works perfectly even um, in the middle of our weaknesses. We give you today and we want to honour you with it. May it be a living sacrifice to you in Jesus' name. And everybody said Amen. Have a great day. We love you. May you be distinguished and not extinguished today. See you soon.